Alright, time to check off some of the Lego Batman movie minifigures they got. Lobster loving. Vacation Batman, my favorite. Police Barbara Gordon. Uh, Dick Grayson Robin. And the Eraser. My custom League Batman movie mock, the Erasers Eraser. So let's see it. Alright guys, so here it is. And you can see that this is supposed to kind of look like a pencil there. I just decided to put fire on the sides. Um, you can see the pink in there. Wish I had a bit more pink. But then, uh, you know, the tip at the end. But this is uh, just supposed to be for the Lego Batman with DCMF, the Eraser. Super cool minifigure. And just goes right there. I'll take a closer look at all the details in just a second, but I just thought it'd be an awesome idea to make a car for the eraser that looked like a pencil. Of course, this wasn't in the movie. I just thought it would be an awesome idea to do that. So yeah, let's take a look at some of the details. Alright, so starting off here at the tip of the pencil, I just have a bit of silver there, so it looks like the uh, tip of the pencil. I think that looks really good, and I'm not quite sure what this piece is called, but I think that looks great. Then it just comes down with yellow using a bunch of these different, like, yellow pieces there, like one of the dome pieces right there, and that's just attached on to the front with, like, an axle, so I think that looks pretty good. Right here is the cockpit for the eraser, and he just sits in there very nicely, and on either side, there's a couple of these new pieces for 2017. I think those look really cool. Right there, you can see a control panel, and I think that worked out pretty well, and then right there is a, like, windscreen for him. So he just sits right there, and that looks awesome. Then right here you can see a couple headlights that are, of course, uh, like stud launchers. And those work in a bit of a different way. Rather than firing in front, they fire off to either side like that. And those are supposed to do that because I just want to have something a bit different. And that can take out two cars that are beside him like that. So that's really cool. Then I just have a bunch of details here with, like, this vent piece. I think that looks pretty cool. And those are just attached onto the side there with uh, just a couple of those like uh, not brack I mean I can't remember the name of the pieces but they just go right there then right here you can see a couple of fire pieces attached with lightsaber uh, handles I think those look awesome and of course this thing would be going super fast so I think those work really well and there's a one on either side those are super awesome fire pieces there I got those from uh, I'm pretty sure the Raid Zeppelin and also uh, the like um, what's it called? Lego Next Knights Beastmasters Chaos Chariot. That was a really cool set. Then right here I'm just using this big, uh, like, Lego car piece there, uh, for the base of it. I think that worked out pretty well. And then on either side here are just a couple wheels. These ones come out a little bit more. And those wheels are very small, but this thing does roll well. Then right here is probably one of my favorite details is this, uh, flag right there that can be adjusted and you can kind of have it look like it's waving in the wind. And this has on it just this little thing that says to erase. That's from the Lego Batman movie you've seen that, uh, the eraser there. Because that was his accessory. I thought that it should be the flag. I think that looks really great. Then right here you can see I'm using uh, this very cool piece. This is actually the chest plate to the axle battle suit. I think that's a really great use of that piece. And I think that looks awesome there. Just really like how it comes down. And I think that's a really interesting use of it. Then right here, you can kind of pull off the back, and if you do, uh, you can see that you can lift that up and put something in there like a tile, so you know, could put his notepad. So that's not too much of a feature because then you kind of have to pull this off, but I still think it's pretty cool. And then that goes right there, and then that goes there. Then right here in back, I just have the metal-like part of the pencil, and I think that uh, looks pretty good. And that's just using a bunch of great pieces right there, and then I have a bit of silver, and then there is the actual eraser that's a little pink tile. I think that that could have been bigger, it doesn't look super great being super small, but I do think it looks okay. And that is pretty much it. Alright guys, so please tell me in the comments below what you think of this mock. I had a super fun time making it, I think it looks pretty awesome, and that's pretty much it for this video. I really hope y'all enjoyed, please like, comment, and subscribe for daily LEGO videos, and I'll see y'all next time.